Hi everyone, sorry it's been a while. I've just been really sick and it was Christmas and the holidays. Happy New Year everybody. And I did a major haul this week and I thought I would share what I got. In a swap I got the Mario Badescu um, spray. This is supposed to be the equivalent to Mac Fix and this is only $7. So if you're in, fix breaks me out. So if you're looking for an alternative, get this at Ulta. I ordered the Kiehl's Creamy Eye Treatment. I've been using this in the mornings under my eyes. I really like it and you only need a tiny, tiny, tiny little bit. It looks like this. So this will last me a long time. And another thing I got from Amazon was the L'Oreal Nature's Therapy Mega Moisture Nurt Nurturing Cream. It's for very dry, chemically pro processed hair. It's made with sunflower seed oil and it softens and moisturizes. I left this on my hair for an hour or so last Saturday. It smells really good and that's what it looks like. But I was pretty impressed with this since it was only $6.00 off Amazon and it's 8 ounces so I'll definitely use this as a mask. Off of Etsy I got this cute um, iPhone case. This is for the 4S. It's just a Naked 2 palette. It was $15. It did come from Thailand so it took a week and a half to come but in the details I'll put who the Etsy seller was. But she was very nice to work with and it's, it's kind of sparkly case. This is a lot nicer than I thought it was going to be. And I went to Ulta yesterday, and on a whim, I got the Bliss hand cream. I needed something. I now work from two offices, so I needed hand cream for my other office. So I have that. And also, that I keep in my purse, it's the NYX blotting papers. I've never used them before, um, so it'll be interesting to see how they work. I broke down and I got the Lorac or Lorac, sorry, Pro palette yesterday. It was just so pretty to resist. I love golds in all these colors like garnet, pewter, pewter, champagne gold. I love all those colors. So I'm excited to try that. I've been on a Lorac kick lately. And also at Ulta. As soon as I got back, I heard that these are crap, so I don't know if I'm going to keep them or not. It's the NYX Glitter Creams. It looked interesting. They looked pretty. And I swatched this last night. This is the Urban Decay Sin uh, Primer. Um, it, I loved it. It, um, it was a very, very pretty base, so I'm excited to try that. And also the Lorac Pro came with their eye primer but I don't like their eye primer so I'm probably just gonna send it to my friend. I got some baby clips from Ulta. They were pretty much out of everything. I wanted a makeup bag, they didn't have any. I wanted large clips and they didn't have any so I was highly disappointed on how much out of stock they were. And then I went to Walgreens. I've been on a quest for the past two weeks to find the Fergie and I just found out in the past day or so that it's only at Walgreens. If you didn't know that, definitely go to your nearest Walgreens or online to see if you can get it. And I don't know what happened to my large clips, but I lost two of them, so I just bought two new ones. And it came with some free hairpins. And from the furry line, I got, this stuff is amazing guys, this is the eye primer. I use this today. Just know that you have to shake the crap out of this. When I first um, tried to test it just to swatch it, it was very, very oily. And I was like, I thought it was crap, but then I shook it for a minute. And I got it all mixed up really good. And I used it today. And it looks like it didn't crease at all. And I put my makeup on at 4.30 this morning. And it's 4 o'clock in the afternoon right now. And it looks like I just put on my eyeshadow. I'm highly impressed with this. This might even replace my e.l.f. HD um, primer. I'm highly impressed with this. This is $5, so if you see this, stock up. This stuff is amazing. And I hope this is um, permanent. 
I actually I wore I think I wore all my furry stuff today this is the wet n wild rose champagne glow highlighter um, since I'm so pale I'm not sure if it really comes across I guess it does but um, I'm still gonna test this out for right now I like my Mac um, by candlelight better but I'll test this out a couple more times before I figure out what I want to do with it and I'm wearing this on my lips today this is the Fergie Bebop Love it's a brown rosy color I'll swatch it real quick but it's a very pretty color it's very 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 creamy and long-lasting um, it lasted quite a few hours this morning at work and let's see, another thing I got at Ulta that I forgot about, it's the NYX HD Primer. I used it today. Um, I'm going to test it a couple more times before I give a review on it, but I got the shade in Fair, and I normally use the Studio Finish Concealer from MAC, but I wanted to try something new. I read good reviews on that. And I just came from Walmart. I've been using the same shampoo and conditioner for probably five years or more, so I wanted to give something else a try. I read great things about the Tresemme Smooth and Silky line, so I got the shampoo and conditioner. They are 32 ounces, and they're only $3.50 a piece, so that's huge. It's going to take me forever to use all these, but um, it's supposed to reduce frizz and smooth hairs, smooth hair. And it got a lot of good reviews um, for curly girls that straighten your hair like me. So I'm excited to try these. And I wanted to try a new heat protectant. So I'm trying the Tresemme Keratin Smooth for Smooth Easy to Style Heat Protection Shine Spray. I've been wanting to try the Maybelline Rocket Mascara. So I just decided to break down and get it since I've been buying stuff all week. And I've always wanted to try this. I just decided to break down and buy it. It's the Phys uh, Physician's Formula Glow Pearls. And this is just in translucent. And I've been looking for these everywhere for weeks. It's the YSL dupes from L'Oreal. And I found um, all this stuff, this last stuff, at Walmart. Um, I live in West Virginia, so I was shocked that I found the YSL dupes. I got Rose On and On. I don't know if I'm gonna like this, but that's the color on the bottom. I'll have to report back on that. I've heard a lot of people complain that they're drying, so. And two things that I got got off the Disney store. They just came out with a new line. Uh, I love Mickey Mouse and I do love Mickey Mouse. I always have and this is a phone case. And I also got the t-shirt. When we went to Disney I saw a bunch of people with this t-shirt and it's oh whenever I try to look for it it's always sold out. So I got that and I think that's my haul for this week. If you have any questions about any of the products that I got, feel free to leave me a note or email me. Thanks! Bye! Remember to subscribe!